Who would believe, who would believe what we have heard? Which of you has seen the mighty power of the Lord? He grew like a sapling, like a shoot from dry stone land. Just like a servant, obeying the Lord's commands. He was not stately, he was not a handsome king. There was nothing much to make people look at him No, there was nothing much that stood out about him But his life was filled with sorrow and with suffering People hid their face, they hid their face from him He was a nobody held in nobody's esteem Yet he suffered and endured great pains for us and For his sins he was wounded, he was crushed He took the punishment, made us whole, and made us well by his injuries and stripes, for we are healed. We were all like sheep, we had gone astray. But each of us went off down our own way. But the Lord gave him the punishment that we deserved. And then he took it on himself without a word. He was so painfully abused, but did not complain. He went to the slaughter, just like a silent lamb. Condemned to death without fair trial, taken away. Who would have thought any more of his destiny? His life was gone for sinful things others had done. And though he was honest, and though he did no wrong, he was taken, he was taken, he was gone. Among the wicked, they laid him in a tomb. The Lord let his servant suffer a sacrifice To take the guilt of others He gladly played, paid the price To take the guilt of others He gladly paid the price And willingly gave up He gave up his own life If he gives his life as an offering, he gives his life to pay to pay for others' sin. Long life shall be to those to those who follow him. The Lord's will shall be accomplished and be fulfilled in him, because he surrendered and gave himself to death. And he was counted among the wicked Because he suffered and asked God to forgive Gave up his life so that others might live The Lord will honor him who made the sacrifice Forgive the money now, now he has paid the price